Hey, it's Gersh Kunzman of the Brooklyn Paper on Sunday, and if it's Sunday in Greenpoint, it means it's time for the annual Greenpoint Mac Off. That's right, I'm an expert in mac and cheese. I've been macking off for many years now, so we're going to see all and taste all the action in Greenpoint on Sunday, starting at the Red Star Bar behind me. Let's taste every bite of the fun. Well, as you can see behind me, the Mac Off is packed. A tribute to the Brooklyn Paper, of course, because we made it our editor's pick this week. So I know people are following our advice and coming to the Mac Off. All right, this is very exciting for me. I'm at the Red Star Bar getting my first Mac. All right, here I go. This is my first bite of the Red Star Bar Mac and cheese. It's got some nice cheese on top. Let's see how it. Very meaty. Yeah, very meaty, very creamy. I've got some experts here who are testifying to some bacon influence in there. It's very smoky. Let's go check out what the experts think. First state your name for our viewers. Dana Rubenstein. Oh, that name's familiar to me. Why is that? I used to work for you. Okay, and as such, you're an expert in mac and cheese. What do you think of the mac and cheese? Well, I don't eat meat, and it's a bit meaty for my taste. Well, Rubenstein is 100% correct. There's a little piece of bacon there, and I am loving it. It is porky and delicious and smoky. I'm, i got to say, an early favorite here from the Red Star Bar. Let's check out the action at our next stop. As you can see, we've got a huge line in front of the habitat. This mac and cheese off has gone viral. Let's go inside and see how it goes. We're down. from the Brooklyn paper, that's why we're filming. Oh, no. How's your mac and cheese? Yeah. It's excellent. All right, we'll be the judge of that. Thank you very much. No problem. It's for waiting. That's it. Thank you for having us. We're back out on the street at the habitat. It's too crowded in there. I'm going to eat my mac and cheese on the street. Uh, nice. The Bread crumbs on top. Very creamy, not that cheesy, and no discernible meat taste, which is obviously a disappointment for me. But let's go to our next stop. Now it's time to mac off at the Mark Bar. Let's go inside. Well, it's Gersh Kunzman. I'm inside the Mark Bar. I've got some bad news for all you mac and cheese fans. The mac and cheese won't be available for several hours at the Mac Bar, but there's some good news for all you mac and cheese fans. I just paid $11 for three beers and a soda for my daughter. That's $11 for three beers and a soda for my daughter. I had to repeat it. It's so unbelievable. I got change. I'm here at the Mark Bar with some disappointed people. First, what's your name, sir? Adam Rath. That name is familiar to me. Why is that? Uh, I used to work for you. Okay, good. So what do you think about the fact that there's no mac and cheese till 7.15? It's a little disappointing. We'll head over to TDB and finish this mac and cheese tour. All right, I'm at TDB for the last stop on the Mac Off. We've been macking off all afternoon. Let's go inside and see how their Mac stands up. All right, I'm about to get my TDB mac and cheese. It looks great. It's big shells. Let's see how it goes down. I don't know if you can hear me over the din of the excitement here, but I'm going to try the TDB mac and cheese right now. Guys, I'm, I'm detecting a little Gruyere, and that's French for Gruyere. Anyway, it's very good. It's very good. What did you think, Dana? This was delicious. So cheesy. So this was your winner? Yeah, it had a very sharp, nice cheese taste to it. Can you not include this? It's so embarrassing. All right, thank you. <laughs> What did you think? I thought the uh, the last entry was, was the best. It was excellent, very nuanced flavor, nice crust, very tasty. That's wonderful, but I gotta say, I'm Gersh Kunzman, and I still think the Red Star Bar with its pork influence mac and cheese is the winner of this year's Mac Off. I'm Gersh Kunzman, joining you from Greenpoint, Brooklyn. Keep hustling, Brooklyn.